Oh. The map will always have a marker of the next destination. Oh, there we go. Get on my level. Get on my level. All right. The, the attack mechanism feels a little little funny, but I'm not going to complain overall. It's it's not that bad. You have to be very precise with your strikes. I do think it's kind of neat, the mechanic where we're actually like towing around things. Oh, there's a save point. Okay. What in the... Do I have to just leave something in there? Okay. Giant, cro uh, giant uh, oyster. Nope, nope. Come back, little dude. Come back, little dude. Maybe if I leave this in his face. I fed him. There we go. Oh, that was worth 10 coins. Beautiful. Uh, we still need to find an extra statue head. So that's, it's saying that's definitely where we need to go. we got to find the statue head. But we can't currently beat the currents. <laughs> currently. You see what I did there? Presently, we cannot beat the currents. And so let's go try to find... The powerful current was too strong to cross. Oh, okay. Merin's submarine would need greater thrust before it could go back. So, the head is going to have to be down here somewhere. We're going to have to just maybe feed this guy enough. Nope, he's not opening back up. So, that head has to be here somewhere. The question is, where? We know that we need a statue head. Oh, the current's stop and go. So we can kind of take uh, take safety out of the way, out of the path of the current here and there. There is the head that we were looking for. I can't leave the head there. Sorry, bud. I don't want to go in there. I don't know what happened to the statue head I had a minute ago though. Is there some sort of a secret here? Oh no. Getting pinned in by the big baddies. Not a fan of Mother Goose narrating? Oh, I really like her accent, man. You don't like that accent? Uh, of course, the, the story's, uh, hey. Oh, he spit that back out? Wait a minute. Giant clams were notoriously picky eaters. Oh, Each so one for seemed to prefer item. a different kind of treat. And that uh, brain-looking thing is probably what I have to feed to this one up here. So the kind of premise, the basic premise to catch you back up. Oh, that's not what he wanted either. So where in the world is the statue head that I had earlier? Did the did the game glitch out on the statue head? We kind of have to have that to solve the puzzle. Oh wait, we can break through that. Can't even tell she has one? Really? Alright, wait till we get a little deeper in and you'll, you'll catch it. Maybe if I can find my way through here. Yeah. Making my way back to you, babe. Maybe it spat the head out through here somewhere. Although it doesn't appear that it did. Where is that statue head? 
No. All right, I'm gonna have to get a good run and go after this current goes by. Oh, come on, really? There we go, okay. So where did the statue head go? I definitely had it when I was up here earlier. So I think something may have glitched out with the game. Sounds like an American? Oh yeah, you definitely aren't hearing it then. She's, uh, she's about as Irish as they get. Hey, well, let me load the game back up. It appears that we've gotten a glitch here. We'll meet Marin again. So now we can do this proper right. Up out of my grill. These critters are just jerks. Like, I don't understand why everything in the ocean just wants to kill you. I guess that's how it survives. Is it, if it kills you, it gets to live. I, it's a very dark world. What's up, Barrett? Oh no! Go on, current, get by me. Get up out of my grill. All right, I'm leaving. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and go put this on the statue. We can come back over here and deal with the uh, with the punks. Get the goodies and deal with the punks here in a minute. Chijoo. What do we get here? Ooh, a sophisticated propulsion device capable of boosting the Amidst the wreckage the of an old Fomori vessel lay an undamaged propulsion device. Marin bolted it onto the back of her submarine, eager to test out its effects on her lightweight craft. Right, it looks like I am getting a little bit more giddy up. Oh, the game is based on Irish folklore. I didn't actually know that, but that makes sense. Given what it's told me of the story so far. it's uh, So this, this little girl's father... This little girl, uh, her father is a fisherman. And she would stand on the ledge and wait on him to come home every night. She would hold a candle uh, waiting on him to return. And one night he did not return. But uh, when she was a girl... He would always tell her stories of of uh, these wonders of the sea that she just thought were these fantastical stories. Let's see. Wonder. There's got to be a way I can get some giddy up and go. Giant clams were notoriously picky eaters. Each one seemed to prefer a different kind of treat. So you can kind of hear it a little bit there. Came for the parakeet singing a tenor? Aww. Oh, he was a parakeet singing a tenor. How about that? Was that any better? <laughs> How's it going, Muse? How you doing tonight, man? So, uh, Geeks Under Grace has their review of this game up now, I believe. Oh, hold on, I don't want to get skewered. <laughs> but it was LJ that reviewed this. Alright, 
I've actually already dropped off the goodies there. Can I come back and save it again? Oh, okay. So every time I come back to that point, I can save the game. When I was a young warthog. Okay, so there are treasures. Those clams all have treasures. However, like it said, they are notoriously picky eaters. And so I'm going to have to figure out what those clams like to eat. That was much bitter. That was much bitter. The, uh, the tuna sing bass. Hammer keeps in tenor. <laughs> All right, I've got 40 coins. This giant clam is willing to give me some more upgrades, but not on the cheap at all. Uh, 150 more coins to get another turbine boost. So we gotta we gotta try to capture, make sure that we get all of these coins that that are within our grasp. In fact, it looks like back up this way, uh, there may be some items for us to grab can we go underneath here ooh there we go and full of goodies can I power through here yes I can uh oh what do we got here this thing is glowing but I don't know what to do with it may just be something we don't have the ability to touch yet. Um, maybe I can at least uh, use my little sprinter. Oh, am I too big to get in there? Let's try to give this a good run and go. Reminds you of Ori in the Blind Forest? Yes, and I am a big fan of Ori, so I'm, uh, I'm definitely looking forward to getting real deep into this. Get it? See what I did there? Real deep. <laughs> Well, I can't get the run and go to be able to get that gold statue yet. That may be something I have to wait until I have the, uh, yeah, the upgraded propeller to come back and get. Okay. So we've got a couple of treasures I can't get to there yet. I guess we need to go down there. So we'll head, we'll head a little deeper into the ocean. Look at all these little serpents. Shady old boys. I don't know if I'm going to like the fact that it saves every time I pass over one of those or not. Okay, there's something mechanical in there. Use our propeller. Oh, I don't have the head to put on the statue yet. Oh, I see it over there now, though. Okay, so let's get that head real deep. <laughs> yes. So I, I meant to ask you, Muse. Uh, I got a buddy at work that said he recently got back into Duelist. And I know you've been streaming a lot of Duelist over on the Geeks Under Grace channel. Um, is it is it basically Hearthstone? Throw an object. There we go. Your puns are watered down, Joe. <laughs> I'll allow it. I'm going to have to mute every single every single channel I'm in on. Mary looked in awe all around her. She knew this place from her father's songs. These were the lost ruins of the Marrows. We found it, boys. The lost ruins of the Marrows. Arrgh. Okay, I don't know what... Is this a gold nugget that I've got? It kind of looks like a big fish turd. Die! Oh, that didn't Lantern work Lantern jellies like blocked Merrin's path. Although the creatures could be deadly to the touch, they were very shy and even avoided each other's light. Sounds like as long as I can shed some light on the situation, they may move out of my way. Oh my goodness! Oh, 
Okay, well, there's a death charge. Oh, what a tangled web we're weaving here. I just want to collect all the goodies. What in the world? Oh, snap, Mary I didn't shuddered, even realize. As if recovering from a bad dream. For a moment, she thought she had experienced her own death. But it had merely been the Tyne showing her one of the many possible roads ahead. That's how they explain away death in the game. She thought she had experienced death, but not true at all. That's almost like uh, Prince of Persia going, Oh, wait, no, that wasn't how it happened. Rewind. All, all around her. She knew this place from her father's songs. Fish These poop, gold, gold were the fish, lost yeah. <laughs> ruins of the Marrows. That's, that's funny, Brad. Fish poop, goldfish. <laughs> so these Lantern things will absolutely smoke me. That's what Although just the creatures could be ago. deadly to the touch, they were very shy and even avoided each other's light. They avoid each other's light, but not if I'm in the way. Then they just want to get rid of me. So I think how I'm going to end up getting to that goodie basket is grabbing this. This is a bomb. Oh, come on. Shoot. Not what I wanted. So I'm going to have to do something to get rid of the... Ah, uh... oh, those snakes aren't scared of me. I'm gonna have to, uh, what is down there? Get up here and get some bombs. No one expects the Jelly Inquisition! It's supposed to look like it's set in a fish tank? I don't, I never got that feel from it, but I totally see how you see that. Yeah, it's supposed to take place in the, uh, oh, get through there, woohoo! Yeah, and it's a beautiful game. So this is created, this game was developed by, uh, Insomniac. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. What do we got? Oh, searchlights. There we go. Now we can push those Marin jelly... Marin discovered two glowing lights amidst the scraps of an old Fomori machine. She attached Get them to the front of the grill. submarine's hull, hoping they would help guide her on her journey. They'll help guide me. Why would I want to turn off the searchlight, though? Like, it doesn't seem necessary. Does it? I'm just trying to keep the jellyfish away. A blur of color darted through the shadows. Oh, it's a mermaid! Was that a marrow maiden swimming through the ruins? A marrow maiden, not a mer maiden. A marrow 